Hey guys, just want to let you know this is going to have to be a two-parter because I have for the last day and a half tried to edit my video but it seems that it won't let me do the full hour so I'm going to be cutting it in two so you guys will <coughs> kind of experience it differently. Hopefully you guys like the change. I hope you do. Anyway. Greetings, Yuga the Cyborg here, and welcome to Night in the Woods, a game I have been wanting to play for a while and I've only just been able to get. And yes, alas, I got no glasses. I can't find my spear and I can't find my actual pair. So, here we are. Let's start this game. Ah, oh, it feels good to be back where I belong. In the year Grandad died. What a way to start. We had the worst flood in 1998. The highway extension came. We had the worst floods since 1998. Greg got trapped on top of a doghouse. The power was out for two days. Casey Hartley came in, uh, came by in his dad's boat. And I laughed when I saw him. Grandad left me an apple crate of books. He loved ghost stories and quoted them to himself in the hospital bed. They feared death. In their wings, in their trees. That sounds like it. In their wings, in their trees. All things die. Be at peace. On his last day, he sat up suddenly and stared bug-eyed through the window at the old parking lots, at the old mill, at the old playground, at the old trains, at the old empty mill. Windows half busted out. He turned to my dad. I still wide. This house is haunted, he said, and died. Well, that's one way to start an adventure. <laughs> well, this is <clears throat> great. Okay, I have to come up with voices, right? Okay, okay. Hmm. A voice for me, a voice for me, a voice for me. Hmm. Well, this is... <clears throat> Damn. Be right back, I just need to grab a quick drink of water. definitely know that if this is going to be one without them talking, I'm going to have to come up with the voices. Goody. Radio. Well, this is great. I mean, I didn't expect a party or anything, but I figured someone would be here. Welcome home, May. Eh? Oh, Garbo and Malloy. <laughs> ha! 
Nah, I'm good. Ooh. Excuse me, but where is everyone? It's 10.45. It's closed. Not a lot of folks get out for last bus to Possum Springs these days. Just you. Isn't there supposed to be someone behind the desk? Or someone at the desk? Closed. Why are the lights on? Why is the TV on? I get spooked when I'm here by my lonesome. Oh. Can I squeeze past you? Nope. Just broke the damn thing. When do you think it might be done? Right after you grab me a fierce, a fierce cola from the machine. Am I paying for this? I always rig it when I'm here after hours. Nice! Free as in free. Free as in no one's here to say otherwise. Awesome sauce! Oh, oh, there's a pain phone here. What does this do? Must be such a relief. It must be such a relief to pay phone companies that Possum Springs gets zero call reception. It'd be cool to call my parents, but some jerk hole took the time to rip it off. Who steals a phone? What the? They have Lime Fiasco, and he wants a Fiasco. That's just a waste. Awesome. Okay, just gotta grab it. Ooh, that is cool. Wow, you got one long arm. Got it. Wow, when did they put this up? Possum Springs has never looked more... falsely advertised. Interesting. One free ass cola. Oh, dude, that is cool. That is awesome. Yummers. So what are you doing here? I live here. Well, lived here. Oh, strange. When do you think the door's going to be finished? Now. Goodbye. Uh, bye. Loving it so far. Well, I'm right outside town. Mum and Dad, nowhere to be found. Dark and cold. Guess I'm working. Alone. Oh, my. Oh. This bus station is maybe the newest thing in Possum Springs. Guess they got state funding or something. Makes a good first or last impression, I suppose. If not for the abandoned glass factory back there. Not getting rid of that anytime soon. This hat is really annoying me now. That's better. Jump. 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 Oh, the train! It's lagging a bit here, so I'm just going to try to get through it. I'm sorry about this. 
I tested it all out before not going through much of the things just go uh, and it appeared to um, do the trick okay I think I might be through the lag but don't quote me on it Through the woods, here I go, through the woods. Ray! Oh, wow, that's a long drop for a kitty cat. There used to be an old sawmill around here, I think. I mean, the park up, the, up there is called Sawmill Park. Looks like it lost a lot log load at some point. <sighs> guess I'm gonna have to climb this, I guess. Oh goody, I love to climb thing. That is so cool. Oh my god, that was dangerous. I could have died. That was amazing. I'm not gonna die in this hole. Huh. Cute little voice. Yeah, you actually stuck this time. Woohoo! Love RT Murph. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Ooh, what is this? Wow, I haven't been here in maybe 10 years. And apparently no one else has. Alright, I'll stop playing around. <laughs> Ahoy! I definitely remember barely reaching the top of this wheel. <laughs> I definitely remember barely growing since then. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, you poor thing. Hey, I said to stop. It's got two, three on it. Okay, let's try this. Wait. This might be the way up. Looks like the ladder's gone. If I could just get to the top of this thing. Ugh. Ah, one, two, high. Nice. Well, I made it. It's only been two years since I lived here. Not in this playground. Have some springs, I mean. This is all getting jumbled. I should write it down. Rest in peace, Granddad. Your parents forgot you. Oh, That is sad. Here's a power line. The voice may change because I'm trying to find the right voice for her, so... Sorry. That is cool. Boing, boing. Woohoo, I 
I made it. Oh. Hello, mate. Been a while. Hey, what are you doing here? Nothing better to do? I was out here doing my rounds when I saw you in the very off-limits playground. So? Get in the car, May. No. <laughs> you want to spend your first night back in jail, May? No. <laughs> oh, May. Oh, May. May, May, May. What are we going to do with you? It's so dark. Oh! Oh, wow! Bless this mess. I should remember to get that for my mum. <laughs> Bless this mess. Hey, remember me? Ugh! Me, you gave me a heart attack. Good. What are you doing? Oh. May, honey, we thought you were coming tomorrow night. You thought wrong. How did you get here? I walked until I got arrested. By Aunt Molecup. Oh, Aunt. Oh, they're animals. They're hard to tell their sex. Oopsie. Oh, did you say hi to Bolly for me? No. I say hi for no one. If the cops. <laughs> I'm going to bed. Is my bed still here? Or are we waiting for tomorrow night for that too? Ah, oh, May. So good to hear that voice again. Good night. Read something there. Dad looks older? Wait, what else is in this house? A nice kitchen? That's about it. They have a cat clock. Funny. What? Ah, it is one of these based games. What's this way though? No. What's this way? Apparently, nothing. Boy, I love it when there's nothing. Oh. There are a few things hanging around here from the old country. This clock, the trunk in the storage room, and whatever's buried under the house after the cement incident. <laughs> huh. What a very, uh... Interesting lass you are. Ugh. Since when is the crawl space all jammed up? Wonder if that can move them. Frank. Still looking to be a really good game. Can't believe I didn't play it sooner. I saw it and I thought for the price it is... But it's so far so good. 2D animation and everything. Creek? Ah. Ah. Mom, Dad and you. When you graduated. Ah, look at all the pretty pictures. Up to my room I go. Again, I'm sorry if I keep changing her voice. I'm trying to find the right voice that seems to go with her personality. She seems... She seems like a uh, out-there character. <laughs> we'll see. And I'm still to hear of this Greg that caught caught on the roof. <laughs> we'll see. Ah, 
my room. Pretty small room. Now let's look at this for us. Not kidding. That is more a chipmunk than a cat voice. Well, that was day one finished. What else have we got in store for us?